Alright, so with that title, you might be thinking, what the fuck is this video about? And uh, by the title, I'm going to prove to you that the world is not round or flat. Anybody who just believes that is a fucking idiot. Now, you might be thinking, if it ain't round, and if it's not flat, then what shape is it? Now, that is what I'm going to explain to you. If the world was round, and you were sailing the oceans, it's not just going to go straight, it's going to go at a curve, and at some point you're going to go upside down and under the earth, and the sky would be facing down and the ocean would be up, yet you would still be sailing. Now, did that happen? No. So, of course, it's not round. Now, flat earthers, people who believe the earth is flat, they're just a bunch of fucking retards. I'll give you an example of one. You have a neighbor named Ron, creepy 50 year old bald guy that lives by himself, never really goes outside, and you always think that he might be spying on you. That is basically who all flat earthers are, and they will try to prove that the earth is flat with bullshit and dumbass reasons like NASA this, NASA that, and just using math that does not work, and it has been proven that it does not work at all. But the one thing they are on about is the NASA thing, yet they're wrong about NASA wanting everyone to believe that the Earth is flat. NASA wants you to believe the Earth is round or flat, yet it's an entirely different shape altogether. Obviously, NASA fabricated the photos to make the Earth look round, yet they also wanted people to believe that the Earth is flat by making it very, very difficult to prove that the Earth is round. But you see, that was their plan altogether. They wanted to hide the real shape of the Earth. And the real shape of the Earth, it is not round and it's not flat. The real shape is that it's a nonagon. It has nine sides. So it's not round, it's not flat, it's not a triangle, it's not a trapezoid. It's a nonagon. But the moon, the moon is a pentagon. And the sun is a, an octagon. But the universe is a trapezoid. Now, the proof that the Earth is a nonagon lies within the continents. But you might be thinking that there are only seven continents. But that is where you are wrong. There is in fact nine continents. There is a continent underneath New Zealand. It is just underwater. And the ninth and final continent is Atlantis. It just sunk into the water many thousands of years ago, and it has just not been discovered. Now, when all nine continents were not submerged underwater, they were all above water, and that equated to the Earth having nine sides, meaning that the Earth is in fact a nonagon. But this could also prove that the Earth can change its shape. It might not be just a nonagon. It could be a cube, it could be a triangle, it could be a shape with seven sides, a pentagon, a hexagon, a cube even, and you would never know. But for right now, it is a nonagon. It is not round, and it's not flat. And if you see anyone who says otherwise, don't believe them. Believe me, because I am 100% right. Now, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see more like this, I might start a series called Internet Deep Dive, where I, as an anime fan, might talk about things on the internet related to anime, and I might not, where it might seem kind of stupid, but I will prove, in fact, that it is not. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to go subscribe to my other channels. The links will be down in the description below. Also, go follow me on Twitter and Instagram. The links will be down in the description as well. And yeah, I will catch you all in the next video. Peace.